Hey everybody, uh, Michael, I'm here again. Uh, I just finished another project for my car. Uh, I did, last time I did headlight restoration, which I hadn't done anything else with that yet. But today, I had a, a beautiful day. I don't have a shop, so it was a great day outside. Wind wasn't that bad. So I decided to do a little rim painting a little rim restoration i didn't get all of them done today because i wanted to get one of them done just to get the process down and then i could finish the rest of them up finish my process and uh maybe tomorrow i'll get another and then the next day next day uh just depending on my time schedule with work and everything uh but i wanted to show you what my rims look like what the rims look like before and what they're going to look like after so uh this is the i did just one today and i've already have it on the car and i'm not going to show that one to you till the last so here's the here i'm going to switch the camera around so we'll be able to you should be able to see it okay okay this is what the rims look like now this car is these rims are factory from the factory car they were special uh feature one of the special packages that ford had for the car and so this is what the happened when they were brand new it was really good they had all that silver shiny looking stuff on there and like they were really looked really really good um and just through wear and tear and the paint was cheap i guess the paint started peeling off and did that this is actually the second set that i had on my car because the first set peeled so this is the second ones i've had and they did the exact same thing now this car, this wheel you're looking at has, this is probably the one that's got the, uh, I guess I want to say the best condition. It's got the most paint, original paint still on it, the other than the other three do. But it's pretty bad. You can see the paint peeling in every corner, and it's just, it's just horrible. And so we walk down, look at the, that's the passenger, I mean, that's the driver's side. We're going to look at the passenger now. This is kind of what the, the passenger See, it's kind of, they just, they just peel in certain ways. I don't know what makes one peel one way, one peel the other. But this is the the back passenger. And this one has uh, probably the least amount on it of the three left to do. And this is probably the second worst one that I had. I went ahead and did the first one. Uh, the one that I was missing the most paint just so I could get my process down and it looks and that tire looked pretty much like that had a little less it had a little less right here painted the paint was peeling off and you can just like I can rub my finger over sections of it and just falls off so that's what it looked like before now through the paint process I, I followed Mr. Chris Fix in one of his videos on how to do this so this is what i did today through following mr chris fix's process i was able to do this and it looks a hundred percent better i mean it's not a perfect job because there's a little orange peel and i don't just don't think i sanded it that well and the wind kind of picked up when i started to paint so it it just interfered and blew all sorts of crap in it and i i can sand it out and repaint it throw on a coat of clear if i want to uh but i'm not doing that today and but it just looks a hundred percent better and i mean it's like if this is over here was what it looked like before i mean and i put the black lug nuts on there i mean this is what it looks like after actually there they are right there and that's what it looks like after. I mean, it's just like a hundred percent improvement. So, again, this is what it looks like now, and this is what it looks like after. I mean, this is my Focus re uh, upgrade, I guess. It's my 2009 Ford Focus, and I don't know if you can hear that, but somebody's. I live in the country, and somebody's shooting in the background, but. But that's it. That's my goal is to have all four looking like that before the end of the month. And today's date, I believe, is the 19th. So I got 
a little over 10 days, not 10 days, but uh, a little over a week to get this figured out and get it all done. I'm probably going to do one tomorrow. This is, if, it's, if tomorrow is as nice as today, I'll probably do another one tomorrow afternoon after church. But that is, that is just spectacular from that to that. And since it, I was doing as a new process for me, it kind of took me a little longer. But, but Chris Fix has had a video where he painted, but the ones he were doing were just like basic steely wheels. And it only took him two hours to do four. And of course, he has a driveway and all the equipment to do it at home. So I had to, I had to jack up my car, put the spare tire on it. <laughs> and I didn't want to leave it sitting on jack stands. If I left it on jack stands, they would have sunk into the ground and I wouldn't have been able to jack the car back up. So I had to put it on the spare. But that's pretty much what it is. And that's, I'm excited about going from that to that. It's going to make this 09 look really, really good. So that's about, that's all my video. Y'all have a good day. God bless.